Welcome to the 1099 ETC program. This tutorial is an overview of the 1042S filer module and its various functions. The 1042S filer supports the 1042S form. The form can be printed or e-filed to the IRS. The federal, payer, and employee copies can be printed. The forms will be printed on blank paper so the software generated forms is required. For more information on the 1042S form, please review the form instructions on the IRS website. To get started, open the 1099 ETC program. At the main menu, select 1042S Filer. Each time a payer is created, a folder for that payer is set up in the work directory. The folder name will then be listed in this window. The base payer is used to set up default payer information, that is, information that will be the same for all new payers. Do not enter employee or form data in the base payer. Click, Create New Payer. Enter a payer directory name. In the example, this will create a folder in the work directory called ABC Payroll. Click OK. Click Yes, to create the payers directory. The folder name is now listed on the Select Payer screen. When selected, any data entered will be saved to this payers folder. Highlight the payer and click OK. From the 1042S Filer menu, the payer information can be edited. Access the insured information, print reports, print or file forms and perform a variety of options, which includes importing data. To get started click Payer. From this command, you can select a different pair, set up a password for the current pair, enter basic pair info or set up reminders. If reminders exist, they will display when the pair is selected. Click Input. The input command is used to enter the pair and withholding agent information and then enter the data for the 1042S forms. On the first screen enter the payer in the withholding agent information and then click the 1042S tab. Enter the recipient information. Click either next or add record to continue adding more recipients. Click print. Use the print command to print the forms, client letters, table and worksheet reports, a list of recipients and print mailing labels. The Align command is used to align the data on the form. In most cases, you will not need to align the forms. Click Options. Options performs a variety of commands including omitting, deleting records, or finding records. Click Utilities. Use the Utilities command to adjust margins, import and export data and sort the database. Click Defaults. You can set up default information for each recipient. You can also designate what fields that can be edited or printed on forms and reports. Click Browse. The Browse command is used to enter the 1042S data in a spreadsheet format. Click Quit. Click Quit to return to the 1042S menu. Click Options. This Options command is used to change printer settings. Back up the pair in view print or email saved output. This is the end of the tutorial. For further assistance, please review the frequently asked questions on our website. Or please refer to the help files for additional information. Technical support can be reached by email, fax, chat or phone. Thank you for using the 1099 etc. program. Have a great day.